Hey guys, as always, it's the Digital Pumpkin Cat, and of course, it's Party City Tuesday. And I hopped on the Party City website, and this one is kind of a, it's of course an inflatable, but I mean, it is animated, so it does count as a, I mean, larger than life-size animatronic, but it does still count as an animatronic, and... I personally don't really use inflatables, but stuff like this I would most definitely use. This is the Beetlejuice Carousel Groundbreaker. 12 feet tall. This is a 12 foot tall groundbreaker. Keep that in mind that this is a groundbreaker. Of course, it's from that one scene where he has that carousel on his head. And even though I don't really talk about inflatables because I don't really care for them, when something like this comes out, though, I really, really am just blown away. And I'm definitely going to talk about this one. First of all, he's retailing for 170 For an animated 12-foot licensed inflatable, I think that's a great price. Um, Spirit has their licensed inflatables around the same height um, around that price, too. Except, again, this one is animated. It's got that uh, spinning carousel up on the top. So, I, again, think that's a really great pl plus. You could bring out the Party City's 20% off coupon. So, that would be great, too. Um, so, here's, of course, a bunch of photos. We've got a video. We'll watch it first. Of course, it's the demo. As you can see, All the, it's just a little spinning motor. And that's basically it. And I think it really works there. And as you can see, I do wish up on top, like, there were the different animals. Maybe even colored, but I'm fine with just the silhouettes like they did here. But instead, they just made it all bats. And I mean, I think that's kind of a little lazy than what they actually had in the movie. Also, there's supposed to be like a Jack Skellington or Skull up there. As we saw in the movie, and there's not up here. It's just a white ball. Of course, you could just draw that yourself. But I wish I was a part to the prop. Um, and the hammers, of course, look really good. I really like the hammers, and it's just very intimidating, the whole thing being 12 feet. So the hammers are really great. Those are really scary. And the body is really... The clothes are really detailed. I like the gold buttons. Then the black buttons, the tie, it's got that nice black and white suit. And the face does look kind of goofy. I mean, I like how they didn't put a lot of detail, first of all, because usually the, the whole thing with inflatables are, if you try to make it realistic, it really looks bad because it's 2D. It's supposed to be cartoony, and I like how they did that. And... I think it's a fine face. Couldn't have used more green. I guess just maybe the eyebrows or somewhere. Instead of just those little green spots on his chin. It kind of looks like he's vomiting or something. It kind of looks weird. But his face does look pretty good and pretty accurate. And he's got, of course, that hat with the bat um, wings and stuff. And I think it's really, really great overall. Sorry about that. Um, Again, here's some more more photos. Here's another complaint. The back isn't detailed at all. Would be nice too, but it's definitely not needed. Definitely not the worst, but I wish it was. And here's another close-up of the face and him being outside. I like that too. Here's an awesome photo right there. And, of course, he's got lights inside. Not those lights. He's got a white light up there, and I think he's got a white light in his body, his head, and, again, in the, caros the carousel. And, again, you can shine these lights on him to make him look great. Just really, really love him. And I know I don't usually talk about inflatables, but, hey, Party City's sneak peek was this guy, and I'd be more than happy to talk about him. I love Beetlejuice. You love Beetlejuice. That's already twice. Let's make it even go three. Beetlejuice. And I really, really do love this guy as a animatronic slash inflatable. And definitely hoping to pick this up. Might be full price, might be on the sale. We'll have to see. But I really do love this guy again. And I can't wait to see more Party City Halloween animatronics slash animated inflatables.